hello so in this video i am going to fix this error that occur when we install a template kit in in way to element so when we go to elements and install kit and here we upload the kit like here i have one downloaded so when i upload it it shows an error so here is the error that is showing up when I try to install our template kit in Inveto Elements plugin. So this is the error that we are going to fix in this video. So to fix this error, you will have to go to your web hosting. So I am using GoDaddy. So I will go to my web hosting. Under my products, I will see uh, the web hosting that I am using. So you just have to log in to the hosting that you are using. So the process is similar in all of them so here is the cpanel hosting that i am using so i will click on manage so here we have to go to cpanel admin to open the cpanel of our website and here you have to search for php select php version here you need to show that your php version is 7.4 or 7.5 it should not be 7.3 or 8.0 or 8.1 now come back to the website and click on clear cache and reset plugin now upload the template kit again so here if your error is not fixed yet there is another way to solve that so this was the first way to solve it so if that does not solve your error there is another way to do that you need to go to elementor system info and zip install so we will go to elementor system info zip installed no so we have to enable it into in our php configuration so we will go to here and we can search for zip So here we can enable this zip and it is changed so we will come back to the website and we can refresh so you can see now it is changed to yes so we know we can go back to elements install kit so now we can upload the file again so you can see the template kit zip file is now installed so if it still does not uh, solve your error you can contact your hosting provider to solve it but uh, this should solve your error in 99 percent it will solve your error so now if we go to pages and add new and here we can create a new page we can name it publish the page and click on edit with elementor and here you can see this inverter element button you will click on it view installed kit so we will also have to install the requirements in order to uh, load this template correctly so you will have to install the requirement that you have in your template that you are installing so if we go back we click on install and here you can see there are different things that we need to do so click on install view the installed kit and click on insert template to insert the home page template into your website so here you can see it is imported similarly we can import the other pages that we want to import in our website so thank you for watching this video like this video and subscribe to my channel for more related videos